lowering blood pressure may be accomplished by eating a diet high in whole grains, fruits, vegetables, and low-fat dairy products, while limiting intake of saturated fat and cholesterol. Be sure to watch this video in its entirety to discover how you can lower your blood pressure without any medication. Reducing the amount of salt and processed foods we eat is often the first thing that comes to mind when we consider ways to treat high blood pressure. However, reducing your salt consumption is just one component of a diet that is beneficial for your heart. The DASH, Dietary Approaches to Stop Hypertension Diet, which was developed expressly to assist in the management of blood pressure, places an emphasis on consuming a large quantity of fruits, vegetables, low-fat dairy products, and other foods high in fiber. Consuming more of these foods, which have been shown to reduce blood pressure, is an excellent way to make lifestyle changes that may have a positive impact on one's overall health. There are even meals that may reduce your blood pressure in a short amount of time, allowing you to get a head start on your road to improved health. Low-fat or fat-free yogurt Calcium, which is one of the primary chemicals that helps battle high blood pressure, may be found in abundance in low-fat dairy products making these products an excellent source of calcium. According to Feller, the addition of yogurt in your diet is a terrific way to get additional nutrients, including potassium, protein, vitamins, and minerals. A serving of low-fat yogurt that is 12 ounces will provide you with around 30% of the daily calcium recommended that you need. Bananas. The typical banana contains roughly 420 milligrams of potassium, making them an excellent source of this nutrient. That's around 9% of the daily consumption that's suggested for you. Potassium is excellent for the regulation of blood pressure, and research has shown that diets deficient in potassium are related to high blood pressure. Bananas not only provide a natural sweetness to smoothies, baked products, and frozen sweets, but they are also an excellent source of fiber. When bananas start to get mushy and moldy, peel them and freeze them. Berries Nitric oxide is a gas that helps boost blood flow, which in turn helps decrease blood pressure. Berries in general, but blueberries in particular, are loaded with nitric oxide. According to the findings of research that was published by the Academy of Nutrition and Dietetics, eating even less than an ounce of blueberries on a daily basis may help dramatically decrease blood pressure. Leafy greens. Potassium and magnesium are found in high concentrations in dark leafy greens such as kale, spinach, collard greens, arugula, Swiss chard, beet greens, and romaine lettuce. Leafy greens are also a good source of vitamin A. All of these operate together to maintain blood pressure. Think of ways to prepare your vegetables that go beyond the traditional salad, such as incorporating them into omelets, smoothies, and sandwiches. Beets Beets, like blueberries, contain a significant amount of nitric acid, which has been shown to lower blood pressure. According to the findings of certain studies, consuming 4 to 5 millimeters of mercury less in your systolic blood pressure may be achieved by drinking beetroot juice. Make an effort to include beetroot juice in your diet, and if you purchase juice from a shop, check to see that it does not contain any added sugar. Garlic Garlic contains a chemical called allicin which, according to the National Institutes of Health, has the potential to help lower blood pressure. When garlic is chopped or crushed, allicin is released into the air. However, due to the lack of data on the usefulness of garlic supplements in treating hypertension, medical professionals do not advocate using these products. Sweet Potato The consumption of sweet potatoes, which are high in both potassium and magnesium, is a vital component of a diet aimed at lowering blood pressure. Additionally, sweet potatoes have a high fiber content, which is another health benefit for your cardiovascular system. Oatmeal Whole grains with high fiber content, particularly oatmeal, have been associated with a reduced risk of cardiovascular disease, may assist with weight reduction, and may aid in decreasing cholesterol levels. Many studies suggest that eating three whole grain meals per day can reduce the risk of developing heart disease by up to 15%. Consuming oats first thing in the morning is an excellent way to get some whole grains into your diet right away. Include quinoa, barley, or brown rice for supper, in addition to a slice of whole wheat bread at lunch. Salmon Fatty fish such as salmon and mackerel are rich in omega-3 fatty acids, which have been shown to decrease inflammation and aid in the reduction of blood pressure. In addition to this, they are an excellent source of vitamin D, which not only assists the body in the absorption of calcium, 
but also protects against depression and regulates blood pressure. Avocado. Calcium, magnesium, and potassium are all found in high concentrations in the avocado's velvety texture. One avocado contains about 975 milligrams of potassium, which accounts for about 25% of your recommended daily dose. Quinoa. Quinoa is considered a super grain. There is about 15% of the magnesium that you need in a day's worth of food in only a half cup. In addition, it contains a high quantity of plant-based protein as well as fiber, which helps alleviate constipation, maintain stable blood sugar levels, and suppress appetite. Broccoli. Cruciferous vegetables such as broccoli are rich in all four of the magic components that help blood pressure, calcium, potassium, magnesium, and vitamin C. This makes cruciferous veggies an excellent source for lowering blood pressure. According to a number of studies, diets that are rich in cruciferous vegetables have been linked to decreased rates of heart disease as well as increased lifespan. Peaches. Peaches and nectarines are like fruit relatives in that they have a lot of the same advantages, one of which is their high potassium content. Peaches and nectarines are also related to one another genetically. About 10% of an individual's daily required value may be obtained by eating a big peach or nectarine. Both of the regulation of water levels inside the body and the elimination of excess sodium are aided by the presence of potassium. Kiwi. According to the findings of research conducted at Oslo University Hospital, eating three kiwi fruits on a daily basis may dramatically lower one's blood pressure. Although there is no miracle fruit or vegetable that can cure blood pressure issues, increasing the amount of kiwi in your diet could be an excellent decision. Red bell peppers. Because they are abundant in both potassium and vitamin A, red bell peppers are beneficial for lowering high blood pressure. The fact that they are rich in fiber and vitamin C also makes them a nutritious addition to hummus as a snack. Pumpkin seeds. The magnesium and zinc that are found in pumpkin seeds are beneficial in decreasing blood pressure. The health advantages of pumpkin seeds may also be obtained by consuming pumpkin seed oil. Please take note. If you want to avoid eating pumpkin seeds that have been salted, look for types that are sold without salt or roast your own pumpkin seeds by placing them on a baking sheet and heating them at 350 degrees for 20 minutes. Dark chocolate. According to research, flavanol-rich dark chocolate has been associated with a reduced risk of cardiovascular disease. This is excellent news for chocolate lovers. The flavonoids present in dark chocolate were shown to be beneficial for maintaining good blood vessel function in the research. Pistachios. Pistachios have been shown to have a beneficial effect on blood pressure by easing the constriction of blood vessels and slowing the pace of the heart. Pomegranate. It might be challenging to consume a pomegranate, particularly given how difficult it is to peel one, but drinking pomegranate juice is simple and can provide you with the same health advantages as eating the fruit itself. Research published in Plant Foods and Human Nutrition revealed that the high quantities of antioxidants found in pomegranate juice may be able to assist in the reduction of blood pressure. Olive oil. Olive oil has a high caloric content, but it also has numerous positive effects on one's health. Olive oil, which is high in the antioxidant polyphenols, has been associated with a reduction in blood pressure, particularly in women. A recent study suggests that substituting olive oil for butter as your go-to cooking oil may lower a person's chance of developing illness and even save their life. It is strongly advised that you steer clear of fats that become solid when exposed to room temperature. They pose a threat to your health if you include them in your diet since it raises the likelihood that you will develop high blood pressure. Let us know in the comments section the foods that you didn't know could lower your blood pressure.